Boo Boo's a real trouble. Wow, he is. Yes. He <laughs> is. Got <laughs> kicking Boo Boo's ass. Hey folks, <laughs> on the series JG. Hi, Bobo the Vulture. Welcome back to Let's Play Dynasty Warriors 8 Extreme Legends Complete Edition, whatever, whatever this is. It's time for us to learn the story of the ancient Ric Flair. Woo! <laughs> Alright, so we're going to do a new game. Uh, we have in progress story mode data that is presumably right before or an interim save in the final battle of. Uh, right. What? So we're going to do it in hard mode. And approaching the end of the Han Dynasty, Eastern Han Dynasty, the long standing rule of the Han Imperial Court was on the brink of collapse. All as right. you may already know. Sounds like that would be the end. Religious cults, tyrannical eunuchs, and other traitorous elements look to seize power for themselves, threatening the very land He's itself. He's got this great star haircut over there on the right. Star okay. hair. In an effort to right these wrongs, heroes from around the land rose up in unison. Uh, Sun Jian, a descendant of Sun Tzu, the author of The Art of War, was counted among their ranks. Oh, he said he was descended from oh, Sun Tzu. Oh, there he is. I count him. During the campaign against the traitor Dong Zhuo, Sun Jin made an abs amazing discovery within Luo Yang. I said Sun Jian. He found the legendary Imperial Seal, which served as a symbol to rule over the people of the world. Oh, we're skipping that part in this, I guess. However, upon hearing this news, the nobleman Yuan Chao immediately set out in pursuit of Sun Jin Jian. As a result, Sun Jin Jian turned to Yuan Shu for assistance, who was in opposition to Yuan Chao. Even though they were brothers. In exchange for... <laughs> what kind of a brother? Alright, so he ordered an attack. Liu Biao attacked. Yeah, okay, so we're starting with the Liu Biao thing. Sun Jian's children, Sun Tzu, Sun Xuan, and Sun Chen Zhang, as well as his right-hand man, Hamdingers. Yep. <laughs> the army of the Tiger of Jiangdong would use its might to carve open a path towards destiny. So I was kind of expecting to open with a cinematic or something, but I guess not. I was expecting to open with something involving Sun Jin, I mean... <laughs> Yeah, well, he's in this battle. All right, so here's the deal, folks. Like, if you've been watching any of the other series, the million other Kawaii series we've got, not counting Samurai Warriors, of course, you'll already know uh, some of the basics of the Soon family. And, like, even the hero mode that teaches you how to run a city uh, in RTK 13 is set before this. But this, your story so far, Soon Jin um, is one of the uh, warlords who answered the call of... I'm blanking on his name, but the guy who, the guy that we kind of make fun of as the, the commander of the coalition back in Dynasty Warriors Five, who, who uh, yeah, legendary banner. No, not not Yuan Shao, but the guy who was like, you know, it is believed that you know oh, this yes. guy could use magic. Control the all. <laughs> it's, it's believed by idiots. Yeah. So uh, they went. They 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 fought, and uh, the Sun family, uh, the but the Sun army actually kind of punched uh, above its weight class a little bit against Dong Zhuo. But it didn't go anywhere because the coalition fell out. So they retook the capital without capturing Dong Zhuo. Or Zhuo. Or they keep changing because they want to say his name. Uh, and while holding the capital, uh, Sun Jin finds the Imperial Seal and pockets it for himself. And uh, Yuan Shao finds out. Uh, and Sun Jin, like, basically fucking lies about it. Uh, and tries to get back to his home territory with it in his possession because he believes it's like a, you know, it's a sign from the heavens that he's destined to rule. But on his way back, he gets attacked by Liu Biao under the orders of Yuan Shao. And this is the battle. Um, it's kind of, they're, they're mixing some stuff here because uh, Sun Jin, like, defeats him and then re then retreats. But then he leads an army to go attack Liu Biao in revenge. Uh, and that's where he gets uh, hit with a bunch of arrows. He's like, I'll just go mosey on in here. Oh, God, archer ambush, and dies. Yeah. And Sun Tzu takes over. So in this battle, he's still alive, but we can't play as him. So guess what? <laughs> There's an optional objective where we can stop him from dying, and if we don't do it right, he gets killed. That being said, uh, you have any preference on who you want to play as? We should get, other than So, of course, who also dies early, we should get opportunities to play as everybody. Most of these characters, yeah. Shang Shang's kind of fun. Um... Well, yeah, I, I have at least two different people that I, or two or three oh, different you've probably never played as Hamdingers, have you? No, I've never played as Hamdingers. Maybe, uh... But, I mean, like, you know, I might have the opportunity at some point again. As you as you note, uh, you know, history spoilers, but Sun Tzu would be the one most likely to disappear as an option in the near future. So I might get in on Sun Tzu while it's still good. Right, I'll take, I'll still take Zhang Zhang, and you can take Sun Tzu. And Hamdingers will be around. Yeah, Hamdingers, well, I mean, I'm sure we'll both want to have an opportunity to... Uh, 
Oh, what's going on here? I so got, I got double him. Tonfas and a. That's the Jing Tsai weapon. Yeah. So there must have been. He's probably a guy who I sold one of his uh, weapons because we, you know, I hadn't used him in a long time. But uh, so Infernal see. Tigers. That's the Infernal Tiger of Heaven. I don't know Hellfire. what the deal is with these. I really don't understand the difference between four dots, three pluses, three dots. Except that four dots is better than three dots. What the deal is with the pluses, I don't really know. Alright, so I've got... Because you've got the one that's doing... Uh, the Infernal Tiger is doing a little bit more damage than the Hellfire, but not much more. Yeah, this one has enlightenment, awareness, and vigor, and it is heaven elemental. Yeah, I don't really understand, but... As long as you don't have two weapons of the same element, that prevents you from switching guys with red <laughs> exclamation points over their head and turning them into guys with blue diamonds over their head. So it don't, don't make that do. mistake. Uh, so let's see. We've got... Wait, what are the elementals on these? Okay, They're... M and E. Yeah, you're good. You got it. All right. Now let's see. I got... Oh, oh sorry. Uh... She probably has improved wheels. <laughs> haven't played Eternal on. She time really move. Astral <laughs> wheels. Ah, it's Astro Train. One of the triple changers. Twenty six. Along with thirty one, twenty nine, thirty two. Wow, thirty four. So Shang Shang has more powerful weapons than Sun does. Well, I guess just raw like damage per hit. It looks like she does, but they're yeah. still they're four dot weapons, so. So I've already got an Earth, so I want to find an H see, 31, or, e or something. 31. Got a bunch of 31s. You had a 34 there. Yeah, I think that's the that's the one Might I've already equipped. Let's see. Frost Triumph Harmony. Oh, that's a good yeah, Triumph is a good one because you get the Rage Gauge going up. Oh yeah. Harmony Jeez. doesn't do me any good. Uh, how does your rage gauge increase if it doesn't when you defeat enemies? I don't know really. Jubilation. Wow. You heal when you beat up guys. Shockwave. Is gonna keep the uh, things on lockdown back on Cybertron. It will use two Muso attack at any time. Probably worrying about this a little too much, actually. Spurt! That's just gross. Uh -huh. Aww. More ass. Your, decree your attacks may decrease the enemy's speed and attack. Yeah, I remember speed. that being somewhat useful, uh, fighting uh, big groups of guys, especially if you're fighting a, uh, an officer or something like that, and they uh, get slowed down. It also slows the... If I remember right, it also slows how quickly they move through the air, meaning that if you get someone stuck in more ass, it ends up becoming really easy to juggle them. That's true. Uh, true Musa. Enlightenment, your rage gauge increases when you are to add ah, whatever. This is the first mission. It's not going to be that hard. So I got two squares, two triangles, and then five squares, two triangles. All right. Uh, Five squares, two, and one, and two. Five and two, one and two. Oh, yeah, and I, I do want to do some stuff. So, actually, whose skills are my... Okay. This is your rage gauge, attack range, attack damage. Oh, I just went all attack here. Range, attack against officers, just she's, attack in general, like and adds a master. bonus for filling your rage, yeah. I might want to do something for... Defense. 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 Let's go, Shang Shang. Let's go, Shang Shang. Let's go, Shang. Let's go, Shang Shang. Let's go, Shang. I don't know if you want to look at your Shake skills. Shake up skills. They're equestrian. Oh, I mean. Son of a bitch. Let's break. Let's bonus to your health gauge recovery. Could be useful. So I've got that. I think Havoc was, yeah, the attack range. Might be used one. What else is there? Any Springs? That's 
bonus to refilling rage. Well, no, that's probably good. I think right now you've got the same set of shank thing as, which is all about uh, killing people. Your wop. I just want to double check her two and five. Okay. I can't wait to get out there and make my mark. I can't wait to get out there and make my mark. Do you? <laughs> no, he hasn't actually shown up yet. Hey, pops. Pops hey, Bobby. Always break down when you need him most. Time for showdown. We can't just start with a cinematic where he gets shot by arrows. Come on. The wind has begun to blow. He's Someone will be betrayed and die soon. He's not Cowboy Bebop guy in this game. Ah, uh, the flagpole. Hmm? What's the matter, Han Dong? Nothing. Oh, I was. Well, I was supposed to meet somebody the for a schoolyard fight. The wind. It doesn't seem like a good omen. <laughs> You're surprisingly sensitive. Quite unlike the side of yourself you show in battle. There's no need to worry. The wind can blow as fast as it likes. All we have to do is stream. run through the enemy even faster. Right, brother? That's right. Where's my purpley beard? The gale that shreds Liu Biao. My whole deal was I have a purpley beard. <laughs> did Chang Chang steal it? You can count on my father and my brothers. I'm going to become Liu Bei's beard. Yes. Well, if you all say so. Whatever. <laughs> we do. <laughs> totally like that. Yeah, I'm expecting <laughs> big things from you too, Han Dog. Oh. I'm sensitive about my size. <laughs> oh, geez, look at that sword. Now, yeah. Tigers of Sun. It's pierced. Show the enemy your terrible claws. <laughs> Prince Albert. My claws aren't that bad. <laughs> First, we must wipe out the enemy forces immediately in front of us. This is it, everyone. So I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna do what I think you're supposed to do to save. Oh. So I'm supposed to be launching an attack on the enemy center, but I'm gonna try and figure out how to get up into the castle before the ambush is launched and start killing officers. Because one of them is like the guy who ambushes and kills uh, the boss. Hopefully, me not being there to help him will slow him down without killing him. You're just too sweet. That's my girl complaining that I'm too strong. No, stop Come forward, cowardly lion. I should give him a test here. He goes like riding on horses, right? No one else in the world will die! Oh, okay. They've 
open some stuff, so maybe this will allow me to learn. Also, Isn't that what we're doing now? We are. I know everybody wants me to take over. Uh -huh. Oh, that's that's, uh, that's sure. not how he thought in the novel, by the way. Just in case anyone's wondering, uh, yeah, he wasn't too worried about not being able to hold on. Oh. I'm definitely the baddest man on this planet. How could my tactics fail like that? Easy, I'm the most profitable bitch on this planet. You're the baddest bitch in the building. <laughs> That's right, it's gonna be Shang Zhang versus Katrina at Lucha Underground uh, Ultima Lucha 3. This is. Hey, Bubba. There's not a whole lot left to do other than uh, continue to hunt around for ways you can climb up and hit officers, is there? Yeah, I'm trying to figure. See, I think I'm supposed to go north through here, but you can't, so I don't know. I'm just trying to figure out how to not get uh, Sue and Jin killed. Well, there's Jian Lang. I guess we gotta. He has to get it further along before those paths will open. Oh, there, I don't know if there's an officer down here, but there does appear to be a base the, near uh, where we started. I guess it's a cluster of troops, but yeah, taking them out couldn't hurt. I, I feel like you've got uh, things taken care of down there. Big cluster than the officers here, but but you have your Sin Jin rage if you wanted, right? Yeah, and Sin Jin wasn't really any trouble. Oh, dude. Sad. 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 Apologize. Because I never worry about them. Okay, the gates are open over there. Now. All right. In case I'm wrong, you might want to come up and like carefully defeat the officer. There's a lot of maybe you have in here. It's a great place to get a thousand KOs, Red Dub. World of Love Dub Dub.
I didn't even like register that this was uh, Wong Chong. I'm just kidding. Oh, we had to stop the wind. Father, you can't die. I stopped the ambush and everything. Don't kill me off so quickly. Father. <gasps> Only a flesh wound. I can't believe this thing saved my life. Well, yeah, you're destined to become the emperor, right? The imperial yes, seal destiny, you right? found at Loy Young? No, the other one. Yes, the one about Loy Young. I got carried away and let my guard down. Perhaps I am getting old. My skin is cold. here. In fact, too old for this <laughs> shit. Conveniently Soon explaining Jen why Sinsu is in charge from now on. You must now lead the house of Sun. Wait, what are you talking about? You're clearly not dead. The future belongs to the young. I'm gonna retire. Run freely. Hunt cowboys. And make it your own. So yeah, that's their convenient explanation for why he doesn't show up in plot scenes from now on, even though he's not dead. The tiger of Jiangdong successfully drove Liu Biao out of Jiangyang. At that moment, Sun Jian became one of the heroes of this new generation. He named his eldest son, Sun Se, as the family heir. Sun Tzu was at a loss for words. However, Sun Jin had foreseen just how great a leader his son could be. The new generation, including Shawn Michaels and Bret Hart. Six years ago, seven years later, a group led by Bian Zhang and Huan Sui had risen in rebellion in Liang province. Imperial Court ordered Dong Zhuo to suppress the uprising. So now we're flashing back. However, Dong Zhuo struggled to carry out his orders. In response, the Imperial Court ordered Sun Jian to assist him. If successful here, then the bravery of the Sun family would be recognized and bear the Imperial Court itself. Sun Jian already agreed readily to the request and took his children with him to battle, because that's what you do. Sun Jin, the Tiger Zhang Dong, is all his son, Sun Tzu, was a fierce warrior, as he was lighthearted. His second son, Shun Xuan, who had seemingly limited potential... <laughs> limited potential? I just love a daughter, Sun Chen Chen. Six years before the present time, the family of the Tigers descended upon Liang province. And they attacked a drone. So this one actually features a flashback battle. I guess this is optional if you save Sun Jin. But um, either way, folks, uh, next time we'll have pretty much all the same choices we had, except the Hamdinger is no longer on the table. No. Sad. Sad. I'm the Serious JG. I'm Bobo the Vulture. Thank you guys very much for watching, and we hope you'll join us next time for more of Dynasty Warriors 8 Extreme Legends Complete Edition, the Wu story. Bye.